Here we go. Look at the rain. The rain uh, late last night and this morning. Hey, we had a nice soaker across the area. Zero severe weather. That was good news. Dallas picked up a little less than an inch. Fort Worth, a little less than a half an inch. McKinney, a little less than an inch and a half. Terrell, 1.62, inch and a quarter. Greenville, about an inch and a half. And Bonham, Cleburne, uh, just under an inch. Mineral Wells, uh, about an inch and a quarter. Great news. Sunshine at 67 in Dallas right now as we look at uh, one of our DBU cameras looking over the lake. Uh, the lake and the highway, the road there crossing over into Grand Prairie, where it's 68 degrees. The high today was 74, the morning low 58. The normals are 71 and 50. DFW since midnight has picked up 84 hundredths of an inch of rain above normal for the month by almost three inches above normal for the year by 2.82 inches outside right now. The cold fronts blast. It's cold fronts almost out of Dallas County, certainly pass through DFW. Our winds are out of the northwest at 24 gusting to 33. The temp is 67 pollen. I have oak, hackberry and maple. All three are moderate and fungus today. That's low. Here's the cold front. Watch this. Here we go. That's the cold front right there. A little thunderstorm activity. Nothing severe. A little thunderstorm from Greenville up to moving toward you in Paris. Cold front will continue to slide away. There it is at 8 o'clock tonight. We have mostly clear skies across the area as we head through tonight. I have no after the cold front slides through your area. There's no rain for the rest of the night. We start tomorrow clear and tomorrow it will be clear and in a number of locations it will be cold at a minimum chilly. The low tonight in Fort Worth is 40. 41 in Dallas. Look at all the 30s out there and anywhere from the northern half of the Metroplex right around Denton McKinney and Highway 380 north northwest and also to the west. Some patchy frost is possible. We had this la uh, same situation setting up last week. We do the same thing again tomorrow morning. No record lows. The record lows, I think 23 degrees tomorrow morning. I'm going 40 41 for a, a low temperature, so not even close to a record low, but the tender vegetation. You need to take care of your tender vegetation. A little frost as possible. We don't warm up much tomorrow. The normal high is 72. We only warm up into the upper 50s to lower 60s across the area. And my forecast tonight, it has all of that in it. We'll drop the 41 tonight. Uh, clear, breezy and chilly. Patchy frost as possible tonight and then during the day tomorrow. Again, sunshine, a dry, cool day with light winds. That'll be nice after the breezy weather today and the really windy day yesterday. 61 is the high tomorrow. There's the next 14 days. A little bit of rain on Wednesday. 20% of us see that, which means 80% of us won't see any. Thursday, it's the season home opener for our World Series champion Texas Rangers uh, sunshine and 71 Thursday should be a great day to go out and enjoy the opening day ceremonies. Maybe the roof will be open. Good Friday this year. The weather looks nice sunshine and 77. We have a map big Mavs game uh, Friday night on WFAA at 9 p.m. Right now Easter weekend looks nice Saturday 80 sunshine on Sunday with a few clouds and right now dry that system has slowed down on Sunday. So the rain we have had in the Sunday forecast has been pushed back to Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday of the following week. And then we're dry as we uh, head into April 8, which is the big uh, total solar eclipse here. And right now I do have a little bit of rain and some clouds on Monday, April 8. Hopefully that system like the Easter system speeds up, slows down, changes directions, and we have clear skies here across the area.